Hey friends, welcome back to the channel. It is Sunday, May the 14th. It is uh, Mother's Day and my mom and I decided at the last minute um, to come up here to Cracker Barrel and uh, get us something to eat. Of course, it is crazy because it's like about 11.15. So um, it's gonna be a long wait, but we decided to activate our patience this morning. Uh, so, so yeah. Hi, uh, two. Okay. Y'all, so it is Thursday. May the 18th and I just wrapped up my work day um, for the day and um, I work from home because my mom went back. I had to take my mom this morning for her two week follow up appointment um, from having her surgery. Everything checked out beautifully. Y'all, she is just recovering so well and doing so good and she's in good spirits. She's feeling better and better every day. She's moving around. She actually um, cooked the other day and we had that food tonight for dinner for leftovers. So great report on that. Just so, so thankful that um, she is on a full speed back to being herself, being 100% and just being able to um, get back to doing the things that she loves and having the energy. Um, to be able to make those things happen. So got that done, but I wanted to come on and share with you guys a little mini Amazon haul. So my realtor, Paula, she um, invited um, all of the people that have bought homes from her, her clients. Um, she is gonna be having an appreciation celebration for us. And so um, she invited everyone to a boat cruise. It's a white party and it's going to be um, on the boat and it's going to be held at, we're going to dock from Lake Grapevine. So super excited for that. You guys know I love a good themed party. And so I went to my tried and true Amazon um, to see what I could find. So um, I got the packages yesterday. I'm about to go ahead and open them up. So here, here are the two packages. It's a total of three outfits. So of course, I wanted to come on here and show you guys what I got because um, I went on there and I just was browsing to see if I could find anything. And um, I got lucky and found some really cute outfits. So I was excited to get these in the mail and make sure that that they're, you know, exactly what I want. So the first one is a black, black romper. You guys know that black is my favorite color. And so I saw a cute, saw some cute rompers on there and I was like, oh, I'm going to go ahead and grab me some extras just to have. And so, let's see here, let me get, okay. So this is the black romper that I got. And it has like the ruffles here on the side. Like you can't really see it because it's all blending in together, but it has the ruffles. All right, has the ruffles and I really like the material too. And at first I was going back and forth with, do I get a large or a medium? Because anytime I go on there, I always base it off of the reviews. And I try to find pictures too, so that I could see someone that's, you know, probably my, my shape and my size. And I can really gauge from there what size I should have. So I am going to lay this one on the bed. And once I have them all out, I'll take the camera and show you guys. So, so y'all can get a better look um, at the outfit. So 
So let me just lay this one out. Yeah, she's cute. She's cute. All right, so let's move on to the second package here. Yeah, I really like that black one. And you know your girl loves having options. So I picked up two white outfits because I like them both, but I'm not sure just yet which one I'm going to wear to the white party. But I love having either a black outfit or a white outfit to be able to choose from just depending on what we got going on. Oh, oh yeah, this is that little situation. Okay, so this one comes in, boom. Oh, shoot. Okay, I did not realize that this was a three piece. Interesting. Okay, let's see if we can figure this out, y'all. So we already know that this is the pants. Those are the pants. And the material feels pretty good. It's kind of thin. So it's gonna show every crease and dimple, but the bottom of the legs it has like these little slits at the bottom of the pants. So I'm gonna lay the pants over here and just try to put this situation together. Move that over some. But then it also comes with, let's see, with like this, this covering that fits over over my top like that. So that's going to be interesting. And then it also has, of course, the, the shirt. And I'm trying to look at this. Oh, that's right, because this was, oh, this is a bodysuit. I did not realize that. Yes, so this is a bodysuit. Interesting. And so this, of course, goes around your neck. And this whole side is going to be out in that little white piece, um, that little white top that covers my boobs are going to go across there. So this outfit should be very interesting. I'm not exactly sure how I feel about it, but let me lay this one out on the bed too. That way, y'all will see what I'm talking about. You'll get a better idea of the outfit with it being laid down. Ugh. Okay, and so for the last one, this one is just like the black outfit, except for it's in white, and to me, that outfit is a pure white. This one looks more like an off-white to me. But I'm already feeling like I'm probably going to end up going with this one because I'm not that crazy about the other one, just in general. But yeah, I like this one. Oh yeah, she's pretty. Yep, she's really pretty. So let me lay it across the bed, y'all. Then I'm gonna take the camera and show you guys what I'm working with. Yeah, there's yeah, this one is definitely cream, but that's okay. They won't be able to tell a difference um, at the at the white party. So let me go ahead and take you guys down. Let's see here. Okay, y'all, so here was the black one that I was telling y'all about. Y'all see how it's, it's sleeveless and it has this really pretty ruffle on the side here and it comes all the way down like that. It's really nice. Like I said, I got this, I got the black one in a large. This one, I believe I got in a medium because they said it was really stretchy. But you see how this right here is a whole bodysuit 
And then this piece right here would fit over um, my boobs and then of course the pants. So like I said, I'm not, not really sure that I'm loving this outfit, but I will um, wear it and, you know, give it a chance. And then this one right here is the one that I will be wearing to the white party. I know that this still doesn't give you guys a full, you know, a full on idea of what it looks like. But of course, when I wear it, um, I'm going to do um, an outfit, outfit of the day and show you guys how it looks. So I guess me being pleased and happy with two out of three isn't bad. I was already on the fence about this one anyways, but I figured that I would get it anyhow. But it was only like 30 bucks, 30, 40 bucks, something like that. So not a huge deal. But those are the outfits that I got from Amazon. Super cute. And my candle, candle burn for this evening. I've got campfire pumpkin going. Y'all, it smells so good in here. And I'm also wanting to finish up all of my candles that are pretty much um, done so that I could go ahead and have some empties. But, um, but yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and unwind for the night so I can relax and prepare for this Friday, y'all. But I will be back to check in with y'all either tomorrow or um, on Saturday. Good morning, friends. It is Saturday, May the 20th, and I am tired as hell. You could probably hear it in my voice, but it is the time for the Costco run. So my mom and I got up, got up early and decided to get out here and get this part of the day over with because I have a hair appointment at um, 2.30. So let's get in here and get this done and I will um, show you guys what we what we get from Costco. Oh y'all, I got lots of groceries, so I'm about to load this up and y'all can see what I got this way because once I get home, y'all, it's gonna be a wrap, so. Ooh, let's see here. Let's do it this way. Like these two right here, I'm gonna put these on the inside.
those are 40 bows. Yes. y'all i'm tired next up kroger oh girl hey, y'all so as you can see i am back home um we went to costco and kroger and got some groceries and everything y'all we were like out of all the things so we had to go and get that done i'm so glad that that's done and over with because i absolutely hate grocery shopping so i like to get up early and get it done so got that done, got home, put everything up, and then um, I'm actually about to head out to my hair appointment in about five, uh, in about 15, 20 minutes. And um, this is going to be my first retightening appointment since I had my micro locks established about eight weeks ago. So I washed my hair and this is the little turban, the terry cloth turban that I like to put on it um, to kind of get some of the water out. Um, and then it also helps to minimize um, frizz and, you know, like the little white balls and stuff that can transfer from regular um, towels. So I'm going to go ahead and take this off and show you guys. So I feel like it soaked up most of the water. Nothing's dripping. I got uh, a set of these terry cloth um, towels from Amazon a while back. So just put this over here shake it out a little bit so this is what my hair looks like right now so you got the back of it it felt so good to be able to finally wash my hair so she definitely has some work to do um because like in the back and around the the edges the the perimeter of my of my hair um, there were some that came unraveled, which we knew that that was going to happen. So I am about to, um, get out of here. I just wanted to show you guys what it looked like prior to me going to my appointment. And, um, I will show you guys, um, the results once I get home. All right, you guys. So I am back home and as you can see, the hair is done, honey. She did a fabulous job, you guys. I absolutely love my hair and it has grown so nicely. Like the growth is amazing. It's It, it fascinates me when you totally like just have, because I mean, in essence, right? Micro locks is truly a protective style. And anytime you have your hair in a protective style and you're not constantly touching it or manipulating it, and all I used on my hair was uh, water. Every day I refresh it with water, but I'm not gonna go so heavy this time like I did before. I'm just gonna spritz it just enough to um, you know, wake it up. But it just amazes me how if you just leave your hair alone, it it grows, right? It just, it just grows. And y'all, the fullness is coming in really nicely. And shame on me, I, when I washed my hair, guys, I'm supposed to bundle my locks and I was rushing, I wasn't thinking, and I completely forgot to do that step. So several of them came undone. So not only did she have to do a retighten, but she had to also repair a good bit of them. So mainly like it was a good piece on this side, like this whole side was gone, then around the edges. Um, so I will not make that mistake again. So she was super sweet about it and y'all, she whipped it right on up. So I'm going to give y'all a close up because um, it just looks really good. My grid looks great. Like you can just, it's just, it's just so beautiful. So that is the back. And as you can see down here, she was able to grip the back of my hair. When I first went, there was that bottom row that was not done. But y'all, I absolutely love it absolutely love it i thought she did an amazing job looks so good and here is the other side so 
Yeah, you guys, hair is done. So I am about to finally relax and unwind. I have been going all day, like literally all day. And I am, I'm tired. I kind of got like a second wind, but I'm ready to go ahead and relax. So I'm about to get me a shower and catch me a movie on Netflix. And I'm probably going to have me some sweet peppers and um, roasted red pepper hummus. I love that for a snack and I didn't want anything super heavy, but I am hungry. So I'm going to have me that. So um, yeah, guys, I love my hair. I go back for my second retighten on uh, retightening on Saturday, July the 1st, which is the weekend before my birthday. So the timing is perfect. But next weekend, you guys, I am going to, is next weekend Labor Day weekend? Yes. Yes, so it is next weekend. Y'all, my days, they sometimes run into each other. But next weekend is Labor Day weekend. And my realtor, Paula, um, invited us um, to, you know, um, to, to a, a boat cruise. Um, and it's basically an appreciation for her customers, her clients. And it's an all-white party. And so I will be going to that. So super happy that I got my hair done this weekend. So because I like when it starts to get a little bit old. But yeah, you guys, so I'll be vlogging that. And um, I think I also have my massage scheduled for some time next weekend as well. But I'm super excited for Memorial Day weekend also because I'm gonna be off that Monday, Tuesday, and that Wednesday. So just super excited for a long five-day weekend to just be able to enjoy myself and relax and get pampered all at the same time. So that vlog is gonna be really good. So I'll be bringing that to you guys uh, next weekend. But thank you guys so much for being here and for tuning into this week's vlog. I will see you all next week. Take care.